New at noon, a crime alert after two very large containers were stolen from a business in Fort Lauderdale. Local 10 News reporter Sonella Sabovic is live where these containers have just been located. Sonella, what happened? Well, Christy, these containers, they were filled with beach clothing. And just about a half an hour ago, the general manager informed us that those containers have been located at a location an hour south of here. We are in Fort Lauderdale, so that is some good news here. And as you can imagine, this was quite a strange and unusual type of robbery because the containers that were taken, one was a 20 foot and another one was a 40 foot, similar to the one that you see behind me. But I do want to get you to some video of the property here because the general manager of Exist, this is a company that distributes and manufactures all types of beach clothing says this was quite a hit to his company and its employees we initially spoke to him this morning but he does tell me he is thankful that those containers have been found and he says that the theft happened around midnight those containers again a 40 foot and a 20 foot were taken from this company it's located along the 23rd Avenue Northwest 23rd Avenue here again in Fort Lauderdale and the value of the dresses and t-shirts that were in those massive containers was get this a million and a half dollars and at least four burglars were caught on camera breaking through a fence and cutting barbed wire just to get inside before taking those containers. It's unclear if the thieves were familiar with the operations here of the company, but the general manager is calling it pretty sophisticated. They broke through multiple layers of security. I mean, this was just a, you know, this, this was a, an organized event. And the property here has more than 60 cameras. So the Fort Lauderdale Police Department, you can see they are still here on the property, pouring through some of those images. And again, while those containers were recovered, it's unclear if the people that took them were caught. Once we get those details, we will keep you posted and pass it along to you. For now, that's the latest here out of Fort Lauderdale. Sonella Sabovic, Local 10 News.